Hello guys, today I want to speak about fighter in World of Warfare. This is one of the class that we have in World of Warfare and mostly used in the, in the game. This class is agile and have a, will have a moderate firepower, a moderate HP and weak armor against other class. This class focus is only the fighting and nothing else. Unlike other class, this, this class doesn't do any other role and the only focus of this class is only doing that part. I want, at this moment I want to speak about Tire 1 to 3 class because this is the class that started playing play at first. Most of the play at this class is similar to each other. The most difference uh, this class have is in the firepower and boosting. No, the power of the NG power of this class is maximum 1,000 horsepower, and with this power you can do maneuvering, but cannot climbing and going high altitude wasn't easy. That's why you should always be careful when doing that in the turn fighting. I, and now I found some of the things that may be useful for you. First of all, is for newbie you have a protection matchmaking. That means the Peru player won't come to your game, and you don't have a, you don't face a Peru player in low tier. Second thing is it sometimes happens that you play in the high tier game with your low play, low tier play. You shouldn't worry about this. When you are at this kind of game, you should always play in your in your green range attitude and do your maneuver. Because in this kind of game, the low tire plane won't go over 400 kilometers as out a speed and you don't need to worry about boom and zoom and turn and boom and zoom and high speed diving. The most thing you should focus is use your play at the most advantage against enemy. The best assets you can use for this for at this and this kind of time is the 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 advantage or disadvantage in the the assist enemy terrain that you have in the lower left side of map. It show you the what have you what ha, what what advantage you have against the enemy plane and you can use it in dark fighting. Another point I should point uh, I should tell is never split your with from your teammate because the range of the, and the range of the gun in lottery is ma maximum 400 meters because the most gun will, will be used is 7 mm and 12 mm gun. If you go out of the range, your teammate can't come support you and you are alone in the fireball. Also, when you are alone in fireball, don't go high because you only give advantage to your enemy and nothing else. Always dive down to the to your AA side to make advantage for your team. One more point I should speak is about a run. In World of Warplane, you can kill someone with only, only Rami. That's the balancing promise, and you should know that. As an example from this. You can only use ramming as a last ex last way for decreasing enemy HP when you are alone. But give advantage to your team. That's much of luck. Another point I should speak about is 
and always clear your teammate 6. This way you will have advantage over enemy by having more gun in the game. In the other word, forget the price, save the life. The more you give gave an advantage over enemy, the better you have a chance for winning. And sometimes you can also kill, do a lot of damage and kill a lot of player in this condition. That's why I recommend you to always stay with your teammates and clear each other trade. I also recommend you to play in battle against bots because it gives you the time to master your control and also adjust the setting for the press that you will be using. At first it doesn't look promising but later you, you will have advantage in the game and know what to do. I recommend you to play enough, enough game in the battle against bot because bot in this mode have a have a knowledge of how to avoid dark fighting or running away from your six and also give you the first basic of the dark fighting. When you are ready for for play against normal plays it's the time you can kill a lot of play and not being killed in this kind of game. As it is game, I can show you, the more you can kill, the better you have advantage in the normal game. And lastly, never play, never attach cannon target with your fighter. You will give a lot of this advantage to your side and also uh, increase the, the gun in the game by one because you are going far from the fireball and also be very low for joining the game joining the team. Also, because of the weak armor, the AA also take a lot of issue from you and you will have a lot of advantage in the game. As an example, I will show you in this game that half of my team will be killed because of this advantage my, I make for them. Uh, this kind of condition we can't do much the only time I recommend you to do the gun that is, is, the, in, is when you are completely winning or you are too far, too far from the enemy to do something about it. also law of HP and this kind of condition I recommend you only to do the gun attack that don't have any aim because if you lose your life if you use your a gap in the game, you will give disadvantage to your side and this affects your winning chance in the game a lot. I hope this guide is useful for you guys and I hope you enjoy. Good luck in the air.